Nick doesn't ask, but I can tell that he's hungry. I was like, from this moment on, what is he pouring on his sandwich? Care it's all about guy. the way you carry yourself and who you feed, and you can get whatever you want. Chat, this video is about loyalty. Are you so loyal to someone that you'll help them even if it put you in a worse situation? Let me know down in the comments. Okay, he recruiting people. This is a this is a, some type of recruitment. He's trying to get some steppers on his team. <laughs> What's the use you have for it now? What's that use? It's gonna crush it up. Man, young kid upstairs has a broken broom. Oh, look at his little tattletale gossiping. Gossiping. That's probably what got him in here. Too much just gossiping, talking behind people back, always trying to let people know what's going on. Chase a bag. Stop worrying about what I'm doing. Man ain't even break the broom for five seconds. He already is a broken broom upstairs. He broke that. Why are you minding my business? <laughs> With a sharp point on it. Oh, he putting it in his jumpsuit. Do you not know you're on camera? Where we see you. We are watching you in HD. That's how y'all get put in jail. Yes, that's broken. Another inmate tells me there was a shank in the dorm. Yeah. I don't know about that. What you mean you don't know about that? And I go and I tell Nick, like, yo, word is getting around that there's a shank in the dorm. You know, just giving you a heads up. Wait, wait, wait. Go up there and try to get it off him. Time out, time out, time out, time out. You sprinkle a little I'll butter on his sandwich, and now you think you in a position to send old boy on a dummy mission? I kind of, I kind of pushed, kind of pushed Nick to handle it. Why ain't you handle it? Why Nick gotta go do it? Nick is one of them steppers. He ain't asked no questions. He said, all right. <laughs> he grabbed that collar. He said, I mean, I make it happen. Nick is like your GTA character. You walk into that little glowing area, start a mission, and get going. No ask, no questions. He just starting a mission. That boy Nick is like a GTA character. He just go. He on I kinda, go. I kind of pushed, kind of pushed Nick to handle it. He was like, okay. Piers, I feed him. They gonna hurt you for it, bro. Let me get it. Man, you got the upper hand. You got the weapon already. How you in the position of threatening somebody? I got the weapon. How you threatening me? I got the shank. I, I got the gun. How you talking shit to me? Talking about you won't get hurt if you don't get that up. You got to fight me for it, and I got the upper hand. I can't let you hold it for me. But unfortunately, that didn't work. So I have to take care of it now. Oh, he is so one I of them there. steppers. Who's that room stick? Give me that room stick. Give me that room stick, bro. Give me that room stick. Give me that. Give me that. Done, bro. I just told him, give me nah, chip, chill. Get up, stop. Keep your voice low, y'all making it hot. They're yelling. Don't raise your voice. Keep it low. Get up, stop. The moment I see that shank, the size, half the size of my arm, I take it. It look like a damn sword. Like Buffy the Vampire Slayer type. Yeah, that's what they be That's what they be doing overseas. That's some type of weapons they use for that overseas drip. How can I be homophobic? Brought it downstairs, broke it up in my room, threw it in the garbage. So I'm happy I got that out. I got that out the door. What? the trick up my sleeve <laughs> he said you thought you got the best of me <laughs> hey yo that's high iq that's high iq he, he was ready for that technique they gonna come question me for it 
give it up real easy, no confrontation. He thinking that he did something. Whole time I got a secondary. He pulled, he pressed triangle and pulled out the secondary. Look at this man. Look at this man. How did he make that? I don't, I don't he know. The goddamn, I don't know. I don't know, but yeah, two of them. Eight. Now. Who said he had two? How you know he had two of them? Now, how y'all get all this information? Somebody came to me and said, hey, Carlos, he has a second one that I didn't know about. How you know that? Hey, hey. You got one, get Oh, it's multiple people staying there. So if he got it, they all going down. Okay. Okay, I see what's going on. I don't care what you say. You're gonna grab that bed and you're out of here, bro. And if you don't want to get out of here, then you can have to get spade. Whoa, he got the shank though. How you gonna fade me? I got the weapon. You're gonna catch the fade me. That's, that's, that's on my, that's on my, that's on my kids, bro. You know what I mean? I told him, you're gonna have to catch a fade with me. That means you're gonna have to fight me. I'm telling you, bro, I'm done. If you got another one, get that out of here right now. There's another one too. There's another one. There's a little one? Black your eyes. Look out. Bro, you gonna get that out of here? Where you going, bro? I'm Wait, what you mean, come to the room? Yeah, come to the room, that is not a good sign. People start acting nice to you when it's time for you to get your ass whooped. Just come over here real quick. Man, just come over here. I just want to talk to you. That conversation ain't what you want to hear. <laughs> that is not a good conversation. Somebody tell you, yo, bro, come here. Let me just talk to you. Bro, come here. Let me just talk to you. I just want to talk. Bro, come here. Come here. <laughs> they act so nice when they try to f*** you up. I respect you. Life is uh -oh. like a game of chess. I think before I move. I got pawns. I move my pawns before I'm gonna move the king. Oh my goodness, Chad. They got a whole council meeting set up in the jail. Nick already knew, like, he had to do what he had to do. Nick on go! When you're oppressing people, when you're hurting those who I with that I call my family, you're hurting me. I will not be oppressed. You know, I don't wanna fight, but I will. Uh, uh, Boy, listen, I don't know why he got the shank. Chat, let's let's do a hypothetical. Why do he need a shank to protect himself from people trying to hurt him? Having a shank created the situation that people trying to hurt him. This the second you whip that bitch out. Like you ready to fight. Like you Darth Vader with a lightsaber or something. You wanted it so bad, now you got it. This is the attention you wanted. You wanted people coming after you so you have a reason to get to cutting. Now he got all the reason in the world because the whole place won his head. He didn't want to leave. He was like, future, I'll catch the fade with you. I'll fight you, but I'm not leaving. No, I'm not going on to bro. I'm not going on to Little does he know that I have enough respect in the dorm that once anybody hears that, they're going to step up and take the fade for me. And Nick, <laughs> See, Chad, this is what y'all don't do. You don't let people just grip you up. He trying to move him around. We got to fight at this point. Bro. We already swinging, because ain't no way you just going to start tugging me around. This ain't no tug of war. Don't do that. Don't do that. He got he got it's not mine. It is he. He got Did you pull that That's not mine. Now all of a sudden, it ain't yours. You ain't want to give it up. Now it ain't yours. That's it, Chad. And he been sleep the whole time, minding his business, Chad. That's how y'all supposed to spend your time in jail. What happened? It's already over, buddy. <laughs> this how you supposed to live life, just minding your damn business. You don't get hurt. You literally can't go wrong just minding your business. You do your time in jail and get the fuck out. You ain't got to build no chemistry, build no friendship. Just get a couple naps in. You ain't got to hurt nobody. Nobody want to hurt you. Just mind your damn business. This goofy ass right here want to be He-Man with a knife. Now you choked up in the corner getting taken away by the cops. What did he want to shank for if he ain't finna use it? You had all the reason to use it right here. He pressing you. 
He making you feel uncomfortable. Look at that. He start gripping you up. Now what? Now you want to be friendly. What you want a knife for? What you want to knife for if you want to be friends with people? No way they got naked. Nick taking a fall for something he ain't had nothing to do with. No way they going to send Nick to the hole. Now Nick don't get no windows, no doors, no communication. He gets sent to the hole because he's trying to clean up a situation. Come on, man. I feel bad, but I try to tell him, life is like a game of chess. Think before you move. And look at this guy. He ain't even, he ain't even getting nothing done to us. Oh, Nick out here taking the fall. I like Nick. Nick a ride or die. I'm pretty sure that's how he got put in the pen. He probably was looking out for somebody he really cared about. He His heart is bigger than his brain. If you hurt somebody he loved, he hurting you without even thinking. Now I got to see if I can get Nick back because that's my boy. That's the least you could do, mister. I want to butter the toast. All this started because he wanted to put sauce Nick on the bread. Ask. Care it's all about guy. the way you carry yourself and who you feed. And you can get whatever you want. Look at this. Want to add flavor to the bread. Now Nick is taken away in cuffs. 